The Sam Hell? For those who don't know, this guy right here, Devin Haney, shoved Lomachenko at the weigh-in, and it's, uh, it's people's talking about the fight or talking about the push. Is more people going to tune in to watch the fight? That remains to be seen. Uh, I don't know. Uh, Devin knew he was going to push him before he got up there. Uh, let's just watch it. Kind of take a – pay attention to Devin's eyes. You could tell he was going to do it. Lomachenko – it doesn't really seem like he knew this was going to happen. So I don't know if that was staged. I think that Devin knew that when he get up there, he's going to push him. Mind game. Uh, he's been trying to talk trash to him the whole time through press conference and stuff like that. So he's just trying to get in his mental. But Lomachenko, he's kind of like, you know, uh, he's just so laid back. He's just like, you know, what's this guy's – why is he complaining about you know, cheating? And also, it's just he's making all these – complaining and stuff this dude got all the strap all these straps it's like if he was the dirty fighter why are you even gonna try to fight him i don't know i don't understand the push that's where my mind is right now but check it out watch his eyes yep oh, right there he look he's trying to see what he's doing immediately when lomo steps up and turns to devin devin's going immediately know and turn he's gonna be ready for the push the, the push he's looking he's grinning takes down There you go. He's ready. Ready for the push. I'm going to beat you up. I'm going to beat you down. I'm going to push you. And I'm going to run. Let me get out of here. Look at this dude. He got all, look, he got all the belts right here. These dudes jeffing. All the belts. Uh, <clears throat> dude got all the belts, man. And he got to do that. Where where is this typically happen? I don't I don't understand. Loma Chico should have been the one doing the pushing. <laughs> oh man, this is wild. Uh, but anyway, they asked him. That set you off to push Vasily Lomachenko at the face. The time has finally come. It's been a long time coming. It's been four years. Uh, I ain't even watched him fight in four years or Lomachenko. Still got emotions in him. You can hear his voice. Listen to his voice. Think you're gonna push him back the entire fight week in the build up to break this you fight. Up. What message would you send? White to dude. Yay! Nigga! Shit your nigga ass over here. Fight. What message would you send to facility right now? Shit. That's what he was thinking. Look at the white guy. The white guy right here. In the build up oh. to Hey what motherfucker! What you send to facility right there. Now what you see start. You see how easy I push him out? If he was a smaller man, if you're going to pose your will, you wouldn't even have to have done that. Now you got, I mean, it, it causes some controversy. If you know, you want to tune in. I didn't really, you know, I kind of want to see the fight a little bit more than I want to see it to begin with, if I'm going to be honest. Uh, smiling, he's smiling. smiling. He's grinning. Smiling. Because he's mine. He's mine. He's Yeah, but he never had the power. Devin Haney never had the power to begin with. If he was yours, he should have always been yours. It's just a mind game. It's going to be a tough fight. Either or. I mean, this dude's holding the belts. They had a camera view that was behind them. I cannot find it no more. It's not the front view. It's on the other side. It's behind them where the, the white guy was standing. And he said, hey! Shit your nigga ass. Get off the stage. Fucker. You fucker, you. Anyway, man. Uh, I don't know, man. Devin, man, you didn't have to do that, man. You didn't have to do it. You didn't have to do that, Devin. This is voice. I was with you in Australia in October of last year. Making weight 135 was a struggle. What was different this time here at home in Vegas? Yeah, I mean, I had a 
great training camp. Uh, I had an eight-week camp with my chef, James Lockwood. We did, a, we did a tremendous job. We did a tremendous job. As a team, I was very disciplined. Uh, I had to be disciplined to, to make the weight comfortable and, and healthy, and uh, that's what I did. And I'm, I look forward to showing that on fight night, how strong and healthy I made the weight and how disciplined I was. Devin, you are recognized as the undisputed lightweight champion. Man, I just don't understand why a guy would have to go that far. Well, I get it's Lomachenko, so I mean, you gotta do what you gotta do to get, try to get that win. It's gonna be a interesting fight. Uh, for one, personally, I haven't watched neither one of these dudes fight. I think the last time I seen, I seen clips of Lomachenko, but I ain't watched their fights. Boxing has been in, in such a state that I haven't even been caring, honestly. Uh, I think the last time I actually watched Lomachenko fight is when he beat down uh, uh, what's the Gary Russell. I didn't even see when Lomo lost to uh, Tef to, to Lo, the Lopez dude. I see clips of it. I didn't. I didn't sit there and watch the fight. That's what I mean. I, now I might have tuned in to see here and there a piece of a fight, but just sit there and watch the fight. I didn't. Devin Haney, last time I seen him fight, uh, uh, man, I think Floyd Mayweather Sr. was training him, and I still didn't watch a whole fight from him. I'm not, I don't really too. I don't really too much care for Devin Haney. I'm, if I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm not gonna sit here and fake the funk. I don't. I mean. Obviously, he got talent. He got these belts and stuff, but he's just not my cup of tea as far as like the fighting. Uh, maybe, maybe I'm being tough on him. I'm not giving him a chance, but I just I want to see people get hurt at least, especially at that low weight class, because he's not gonna finish his career right there. He's gonna have to move up. He's not. He's done, his power is just God. I hate watching people that don't have no power, dude. None. Lomachenko was 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 putting hands on folks, and it just I don't know, man. Uh, are y'all excited for this fight? So you know, I'm just gonna tune in, just like everybody else, watch the fight, and then I'll do a little video aftermath, post fight or whatever. Uh, I really don't care who win, honestly. Uh, I don't have no favorites. I don't. Really, I can't really talk on it because I don't really know what I'm talking about on this fight. I'm just gonna be honest with you. And watching these dudes fight. But I'm going to start trying to catch up and get back in rare form on some of these fighters that I don't watch. There's so many fighters that I need to check out. I'm just being lazy. What y'all think about the this fight? Y'all excited? <laughs> who going to win? Y'all tell me who going to win.